Hi, I'm Debbie, and welcome to my channel, Divine Destiny with Debbie. Today we're reading for June 5th and 6th, that's Wednesday and Thursday, for my Capricorns. Hello, my Capricorns. So I have, you know, I am using Radley Valentine's Archangel Power Tarot Cards. I have prayed, meditated, and infused the deck with Reiki energy. And remember, this is a general reading. It may or may not resonate. Take what you like, leave the rest. Thank you again, always, for subscribing, for liking, for sharing. I really do appreciate you and your support, so thank you. Okay, so let's just go one more time. We're going to cut the deck. We're going to go right into our reading. Glasses on so I can see. And three, and see what we have here. Okay, three cards down. First card, the sun. Whoa, Archangel Uriel, the sun, major arcana, you know, very much the sun is shining on you, happy outcomes, you know, things are going to be going really well for Wednesday and Thursday, they, at least the energies are saying that this is very positive energies for you. So life is wonderful, thrive through the power of positive thinking. And that is something that my Capricorns, um, I have to actually say this about you is when you set your mind to be positive in your thinking, you really do a really good job of that. Um, you know, doubt, doubt does come in a lot of times, you know, that, that just that those questions, those things that, you know, you're, you're not quite sure of comes in. But when you're say, but when you put your mind to it or put your mind to anything, you can make things happen. So this is, you know, again, power of positive thinking and inspiring success. So this is really good time for you to go out and um, accomplish something. I don't, okay, whoever that is for. Okay, your next card, this is reverse, so that means, hey, pay attention to me. The Five of Michael. Now these are a little bit different. So Michael represents our air signs in this, okay? And air is our Gemini, Libra, and Aquarius, our thoughts. Five is about changing our thoughts, you know, so this is, if you're not necessarily having this positive type of thinking, really, really reach down and really pull that up so that you can start, you know, emanating this. And that's what I'm feeling, like you need to emanate the positive thinking. So this one is, this situation doesn't serve you. Release your attachment to the outcome. Consider taking a more uplifting approach. So, you know, you've got this ability, you have this actually, you know, it's very much ingrained in you that when you put your mind to it, you can make things happen. But, you know, the thing is, where are you putting your mind? Where are you putting your energy? Where are you doing this? You know, so this is going to be kind of about choices and for you with your energies, okay? You can make it very positive. You may not. You may be kind of in that time where you can say, yeah, but you know what? Maybe I need a good little pity party here, okay? And I don't blame you for that. But but it's really your it's it's is it you know it, it's going it's really your decision on how you're going to put that energy out. Now, does that mean that everything you know you put out the positive? Does that mean that everything's going to come into your lap and you know all wonderful things? It might, but it, you know, but it doesn't mean that. But you will actually be happier if you can do that. Okay, last card. Again, this is reversed. The nine of Raphael is, you know, Raphael then, you know, um, represents water, okay? And this is the nine of cups, nine of water. Water is our Cancer, Scorpio, and our Pisces energy. But here, make a wish. Dreams become reality. A joyful time of life. So the thing is, you've got this energy that wants to be used by you. You've got this positive energy that says, hey, you know, pull me in, use me, use me. You've got, you know, you've got possibility of wishes to come true. The thing is, what are you holding back? You know, what are you holding back? Why aren't you going with it, you know? Eh, maybe it's just a low slump. Maybe it, the energy's just a little bit low for you. Again, my Capricorns, you've got abilities to make things happen for yourselves. Okay. So my Capricorns, as always, know that you are loved and be blessed. Bye-bye.